Okay, so now let's try using Canva to combine and merge video clips. So I have here our video. And one perfect example of merging videos is when you want to add your intro and outro to your videos. Um, just so you can make your videos more on brand and consistent across your marketing. So I've uploaded our intros and outros here. And the way to add them is to click the plus sign down here. It says add page. Now we've created a new page for the intro. So we want another page for our outro as well. And then once you have two pages over here, you can drag oh, like drag your main video in between two and three, just so we have that sequence and we can arrange it by intro, main video, and then outro. So any videos you want to add in between, you can just add and then drag it in the middle. Now we can click on page one and here is where we can drag our intro. So there we have our intro. Um, I suggest you get someone else to create your intro and outro. Um, they are quite complex and they cannot be easily created on Canva on your own. Um, logo animations are on the next level and it would be best to leave them to professionals. I mean, PF might be able to help you with yours. Um, so that you can have that clean and crisp um, intros and outros for your videos. So now for the outro on the third page, just click on the, on the third page and you can drag the outro onto the artboard. Now, as you can see, this works as frames and per frame, you can add a specific video you want to kind of combine or merge with others. And up here we have like a play button wherein you can click and watch your whole timeline. So all the frames will be played here. And this is where you can check whether the transitions are good, if they flow nicely. And if not, you can always go back and trim parts of it. Okay, so sometimes I move forward so I can definitely see that cut between um, the videos and then how they transition, whether if they flow correctly or not. And then you can always go back to parts of your videos and click on the video and you can even trim them more so that they kind of flow better. And then once you're done and happy with how everything looks, you can click on the download video right here and make sure you tick on the all pages if you want, um, if you want to download all the frames as one single video file. And then make sure it's an MP4 so that it plays with sound. And once you're happy, you can download and then, yeah, you can save it. Save it on your computer and then you can post it and share it online.